Hey guys, welcome to your love reading for uh, Scorpio. This is going to be for your June 2024. You can apply this to your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. We are going to take a look and see what is going on with you guys in love and the person that you are connecting with. And then we will take a look at your person to see what their true feelings and intentions are towards you. And then we'll finish off three to see what else you guys need to know, look out for, work on, apply this to your own unique situations. Keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. If this message didn't resonate with you, you may take a look at your placements keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective um for the collective uh Scorpio people not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular. Uh, so if you're looking for a reading that's tailored specifically to your unique situations and your energies, I suggest you to uh, book a personal reading with me. The link for that is in the description box below. Like, share, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post, when I go live. Also, if you guys are interested in following me on TikTok, Instagram, my other YouTube channel that's dedicated solely to my travels, the links for those are in the description box below support me on there too uh what else um that's it so scorpio tell me about scorpio and love and the person that they are connecting with for the second half of their june from the 16th to the 30th sun moon rising venus signs for scorpio for scorpio and we have the two of swords here someone here is really indecisive here. Someone that you're dealing with is really indecisive. It's interesting with this two of swords here. This basically, this angel, it has an arrow that's stabbing this person in their heart here. Like, I feel like someone here's, uh, someone's heart is about to be broken here, okay? You know, with the queen of wands here, you know, this could be a situation that you're dealing with someone here that's really non-committal here, okay? This person's only, yeah, ace of wands here. You're dealing with someone here that's only looking for sex here. Perhaps you're only looking for sex, okay? Perhaps there is a secret being revealed here that this person could be dealing with other people here. Someone here could be dealing with other people, okay? So we have the queen of, uh, no, the um, ace of wands here and the moon card in the reverse here, okay? You know, I feel like in this situation i feel like it's important for you scorpio is to trust your intuition here we have the knight of swords libra Aquarius, gemini yeah there's some sort of truth that's coming out that this person is basically you're dealing with someone here that's like exploring other options here okay so the two of swords and the page of cups cancer scorpio pisces the page of queen of wands here and the two of pentacles yeah look at how this person is like kind of like looking at you you know i feel like this you know this person gives off this vibe that okay you know they're hiding something you know even they, they if they tell you that they're not you just know that this person's hiding something here we have the ace of wands and the nine of cups we have the moon card in the reverse and the seven of swords here this person has basically been lying to you here okay scorpio this person has been lying to you all this time and you're about to find out the truth here you might be you might be getting it from a birdie here someone here someone else might be telling you that hey your person's doing this behind your back i'm seeing your person holding hands sucking face with other people in the street here you know the sun leo energy and the five of pentacles here this person's gonna end up alone because i feel like one of the things i'm getting here is i feel like not only are they playing you but this person's also playing the third party here too or third parties what else do we have here for Scorpio, the person that Scorpio is dealing with, thinking of, what is this person's true feelings and intentions towards Scorpio? What is this person's true feelings and intentions towards Scorpio for um, the second half of their June from the 16th to the 30th? We have the High Priestess and the Four of Wands here. The High Priestess, Cancer, Pisces, the Four of Wands. We have the Five of Wands here and the Hermit Virgo energy. Wow, this person's like running away scared. Yeah, this person's like, this person's wishing that they could disappear because whatever this person has done, not just to you, but to other people here, this person's like really embarrassed here. Yeah, this person's really embarrassed about what they did. We have the lovers here, Gemini Energy, the lovers and the two of wands. Yeah, this person's like dealing with multiple people here. You know, I feel like they're with you for a reason because I feel like this person sees you as someone who's very financially stable, very financially secure, and you could offer them something that they don't have themselves or that they can't get it anywhere else. And I feel like that's why this is an individual that, you know, keeps you around. Tell me about the uh, 
Five of Wands, and the Ten of Swords as well. The Four of Wands, and the Three of Wands, the High, High Priestess, and the Wheel of Fortune here. This person has been hiding secrets from you, and keep in mind, secrets and lies don't stay hidden for a long time. It always has a way of coming up to the surface here, and it's coming up to the surface, and it's biting this, per this person in the butt. <laughs> and basically this person's wishing that they could just disappear because I feel like this person's really embarrassed. Okay, what else do we have here for? Scorpio. What else does Scorpio need to know? Look out for work on when it comes to this love situation. For the second half of June from the 16th to 30th, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Scorpio. We have the Ace of Swords and the Page of Swords, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. Okay, Ace of Swords, Page of Swords here. We have the Page of Pentacles here and the Queen of Pentacles, both Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. And we have the Six of Swords and the Queen of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. There's a lot of people in the picture here. The truth is coming out here, and I feel like it's like kind of like a game of telephone here too, because I feel like people that have been victim to this person here is talking about this person, you know, is connecting. Basically, there's common ground that you guys are speaking on here. Knight of Wands here, Aries, little Sagittarius energy. We have the Page of Swords here in the Hangman. Here's the thing, because of how this person behaves some of you guys could be having some sort of like medical issues here you know stds stis and stuff like that i feel like for some of you guys it, you know it might be important to get checked here especially the way that this person is behaving it doesn't hurt to get checked even if like nothing comes up or that this person's telling you that they don't have anything right so we have the magician here gemini virgo and the page of pentacles and the queen of pentacles and the queen of swords leap real quick there's a lot of people here that's coming forward yeah I do feel like, you know, this person's embarrassed about, you know, what they have done here. You know, I feel like this person is embarrassed about, you know, their behavior here or that they're embarrassed that they couldn't hide this better here. Okay, we have the Six of Swords, the Seven of Wands, and the Ten of Pentacles here. So one of the things I'm getting here is I feel like, you know, you could be moving forward. You know, you could be moving forward, learning from your lessons here regarding this person and trying to move on from this, you know, and trying to like you know, seek out, you know, the person that you're meant to be with somewhere else because you're not going to get it from this person here. You know, like I said, I feel like you got played here and I also feel like the third parties got played here too. All right. So Scorpio, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If, if it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like this video, share this video, subscribe, hit the notification bell. I'll speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks guys. Bye.